Hello everybody, I'm Mr. Craven, and this is Luggage. Yeah, this is a horror game I found on Itch.io. Link is down in the description. We're basically transporting a mysterious object. We have no idea what's in it, but I guess we're gonna figure it out. Let's do it. <laughs> what a rough trip. Oh, okay. We arrived in Los Angeles. Thank you for flying Hubris Airlines. Can I go back here? Can I can I sit back down? I think I like this like uh What am I gonna tell Jessica? Oh Jessica. I like this like 50s, 60s design. Oh, there's a little bit of a sprint. She will never forgive me. <laughs> Oh, Jessica. Please forgive me, Jessica. I love you, my sweet Jessica. Don't Hi. forget your luggage, sir. You should see it on your way out. All right. Thank you. Damn. I love this. I want to go to like a 1950s slash 60s, 70s, 60s airport like this. I bet everybody's like smoking indoors. Ooh, ooh. This I love. <laughs> I like the use of uh, flat PNGs to look like window shops or shop windows. There we go. There goes my luggage. All right, let's grab it. Need to use a payphone to call a taxi now. Add a one-player luggage home. to inventory. Play your luggage. Let me get home first. That scales luggage. What am I gonna tell the cops when they find out he's missing? Is this like a denim piece of luggage? Like jean luggage? Juggage, if you will. <laughs> so, this friend Gail is missing. And also, is there anything else in the journal? No? Okay. You can see, like, if we could look at the previous entries and figure out what happened to Gail. Ah. Payphones. Holy shit. I need a ride home. I'm at the Hubris Airport. Sure thing, sir. May I get your name? Steve. Steve. Great, Steve. A cab will be on its way. Thank you so much. Okay, here we go. What? Oh, this is like the... Obedience, hammering you down. What is this? It looks like the body scanner thing. Hello, everybody. Wow, oh. that was quick. That was quick. Oh, Jessica. Can't wait to see you, Jessica. What's up, bruh? Oh, that was very quick. Okay. Do you have any mail? No? All right. Let's go to our apartment. Home sweet home. Man, I regret camping with Gale. Knew it was a bad idea. Did y'all have a broke back mountain situation up there? I know what they were doing up there, and it wasn't fishing. Jack Twist. Jack Nasty. Did you leave the TV on? Till this day, the I always have to unpack and think about what I'm going to tell Jessica. Aww. The neighborhood of Ellendor was left in shock. A man in his 60s found dead at his front lawn. But that was only his body. His head is yet to be found. The killer likely took it as a trophy. A manhunt was underway for the unknown killer with the only description of him looking like a camper. That was the only witness description of the killer. 
with what the police knew so of them, our friend Gail is the killer the woods near the neighborhood for any campsites police have reports of an airplane passenger who left the country matching his description are we the killer How I swear to God if we if we open up our suitcase and a mystery on the night of Halloween in 1970, hey, a man was butchered at his home. Till this day, the killer was never found. The neighborhood of Ellendor was left in shock. Okay, now it's just repeating. Man okay. In the 60s found dead uh, how do I... But that there we go. Unpack my luggage. His body. If the head's in here, I'm gonna lose it. <laughs> what? What? <laughs> what just happened? Am I... What the fuck? Am I reliving this nightmare again? Oh, I'm out in the woods. I'm out what in the woods I where I was thinking? camping. What? I wish I'd never thought about it. Should have just cut the firewood and went back to camp. Did he? I wonder if he saw Gail doing some nefarious shit. Why? Just why couldn't I let the past be and moved on? This is awesome. Like this is actually like very cinematic. I'm really enjoying this. Oh no! Ugh. I'm so sorry, Gail. I'm sorry. Nani? So we kill Gail. How can I live with myself? I'm a monster. Oh my god, we fucking bury him. So I know it's me, buddy. I'm right here. I can't even look away. Like the mouse is locked. I'm right here. Stop turning. Stop doing that. I'm going to guess that we found out that Gale was the killer, and so we kill him, or we really are just- I'm going to do it this time. I'm going to kill myself. Maybe that's why I'm here. So before we just thought about it, but this time, in our nightmare. Oh, oh shit! Oh! Oh! <laughs> I was really liking that. Ah! Thank you, textures.com, for the textures. I really liked that. I I was really getting into that. Like, if that could have expanded by like five or ten more minutes, it would have been. Mwah. Damn, that, like I I was really like I was hooked. I was like making up like theories and all sorts of other things that were gonna go on. And nope, just time to do a, a free base jump without <laughs> a parachute. Well, damn. All right. Thanks for watching, everybody. I hope you enjoyed. Really, like, I really hope that they expand on this, because that was... I was I was getting into it. But yeah. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Uh, be sure to check out my Patreon. It really helps out. going to be doing... Uh, playing Bloodborne currently. Doing more... Uh, doing another recording session of that this weekend with my boyfriend. Uh, also going to be doing Cult of the Lamb. Cult of the Lamb. There we go. Um, for Patreon. Going to be naming everybody in my cult after my patrons. Yeah. Um, follow me on Twitch. Been streaming a lot. Twitch.tv forward slash Mr. Craven. And follow me on Twitter at Mr. Craven. Thanks, everybody.